Hi, hello, welcome back to Sri's channel. In this video, we are going to know about the sounds in English and we are going to know clearly about pure vowel sounds in English. So, without delay, let's get started. As we all know, English alphabet consists of 26 letters and they have uppercase and lowercase. And there are 5 vowels out of 26 alphabets. They are A, E, I, O, U. The remaining 21 letters are called consonants. Have you ever thought why A, E, I, O, U only vowels? Why can't the remaining letters be also called as vowels? There is a reason why these letters only called as vowels and why not others? Because when we speak A, E, I, O, U, we can speak them independently. We need not depend on any other and we can freely speak them. But when we speak their consonants like B, C, they are dependent. When we pronounce B, observe B. So you are getting E sound. C. D. F. 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 G. H. H. J. K. L. L. M. So when we speak these words, they are, these letters, they are clearly dependent on vowels. So only we have 5 vowels. Out of 26 letters, we have 44 sounds in English. 20 vowel sounds, 24 consonant sounds. All those are broadly divided into 3 sounds. That is vowel sounds, consonant sounds and diphthongs. So 26. How many alphabets we have? 26. But how many, sound we, but how many sounds we have? 44. In that 5 letters are vowels. 5 vowel letters gives us 20 sounds. Those 20 are again divided into 12 pure vowel sounds and 8 diphthongs. In these 12 sounds, in these 12 sounds, again it is broadly divided into 5 large vowel sounds and 7 short vowel sounds. The 21 consonants are, gives us 24 sounds. In that 24, voiced sounds are 15, voiceless sounds are 9. So as I already told you, vowel sound, when we sound a vowel sound, we make our breath flow out freely without getting blocked. Such sounds are called vowel sounds. So once again, I have divided clearly so that it can be easy for you to understand. Because human psychology is what we heard, we will forget soon. But what we see, it takes time to forget. So according to that psychology, I have written this. 44 sounds. How many sounds we have? 44 sounds are divided into 20 vowel sounds, 24 consonant sounds. In that 20, 12 are pure vowel sounds, 8 are diphthongs. In that 12 again, 5 long vowel sounds and 7 short vowel sounds. Now 24 consonants are divided into 15 voiced consonant sounds, 9 voiceless consonant sounds. In this video, we are going to learn about 20 vowel sounds that is pure vowel sounds and diphthongs and in pure vowel sounds, 5 long and 7 short we are going to learn. Yeah, now we have reached the interesting phase of vowel sounds. So we have 20 vowel sounds in that again 12 pure vowels and 8 diphthongs. So that 12 pure vowels are again 7 short and 5 long. So I have given you clear explanation with examples.
Yeah, now we are going to start the interesting phase of vowel sounds. As we have already discussed, let us once again discuss. Vowel sounds are 20 sounds. Pure vowels are 12, diphthongs are 8. In that 12 pure vowels, 7 are short and 5 are long. So let's get started. The first short sound, E. The letter is I, but the sound is E. So, sit, ink, ill, it, etc. So, letter I gives you E sound. That is short vowel sound. Coming to long vowel sound, you might have observed two dots. So, long vowel sound denote, long vowel sounds are denoted with two dots. That is, now here, I two dots gives you E sound. Short, long. So, short E, long E. E, seat, east, eagle, etc. So, we can't uh, read like seat, ink, eel, eat. We should not. So, this is short vowel sound. Sit, ink, ill, it. This is long vowel sound. Seat, east, eagle. Is it clear? Now, the second one. A sound. Short A. This symbol denotes A sound. Cut, shut, cup, etc. Coming to long vowel sound, A sound. So, A with two dots gives you long A sound. That is, arm, ask, calm, car, father, etc. You can't pronounce like um, ask, come, car, father. You can't. So, short vowel. Cut, shut, cut, etc. Long A sound that is A with two dots. Small oval sound is this symbol denotes small oval sound, small A sound. This symbol denotes long A sound. Coming to U, this symbol denotes short oval. Cook, look. Book, took, etc. Coming to long U sound. U. So, U with two dots. As I already told you, two dots. Long oval sounds are denoted with two dots. So, U. Small U with two dots denotes U sound. For instance, spoon, food, fool, shook. Etc. You can't say food. Food. So this is small oval sound. Small woo sound. This is long woo sound. Next. O. Short O sound. Port. Shut. Dot. Etc. O sound. Long oval sound. O. Call. Oh, all, call, brought, sought, etc. So, O sound. Inverted C like and two dots. Small letters, small sound. Short oval sound, long oval sound. O, O, port, shut, dot, O, shut, dot. Coming to next one, R. This symbol denotes R sound. Picture, lecture, smaller, larger, R, R, R sound. Picture, lecture, smaller, larger. And this symbol denotes long R sound. R, pearl, earn, earn. Girl, turn, R, R sound, R sound. 
next is one is a don't get confused e gives you a sound i gives you e sound i gives you e sound e gives you a sound we generally think that e e sound but e gives you a sound so we need to pronounce like get set a a at so get set red bell we can't pronounce with e get seat you can't pronounce so a get set a a red elephant so only elephant we say elephant we won't say bell and the last sound is ya cat a ya ya so this symbol denotes ya cat rat bat mat okay so these are vowel sounds let us now learn about eight diphthongs so what are diphthongs diphthongs are combination of two vowel sounds till now we have learned 12 7 short plus 5 long 12 vowel sounds we have learned combination of that two vowel sound gives you diphthongs so first one e i it gives you a sound like gate wait mail fail fake late etc so we need to pronounce a sound a gate wait mail so next one is the symbol with i so i i i so night kite fight die etc i a i e i night kite fight die etc so why to learn these sounds to pronounce as native speaker we need to have grip on this so only we are learning next one third one the c inverted c with i gives you o i sound like boil oil soil foil o i sound next one is au this two letters gives you au sound crown town brown cow now au au sound crown town au sound next these two letters gives you o sound o sound observe these two there are there is difference between these two letters these two sound words see here so o o gold fold told potato tomato next o a sound o a sound po to sha nature then the next sound is e a e ya ya so a ya fa le ya ste e a sound then the last sound is e ya e ya e ya ni ya fi ya e ya e ya sound so ni ya fi ya we don't pronounce fear fia tear dear dir we won't pronounce right i hope you have understood if you like my channel please support my channel like it share it comment it and subscribe it thank you